Well, hello, people. It's been a minute. See what I see down there? Just your typical oversized mud puddle pond full of flat water. See what I see up there? Finally, we have clouds in the sky. We have water on the ground, aka H2O, and we have clouds in the sky, aka H2O. Water, water. Do any of you see the conflict here? How do we have water down here on Earth being held down by gravity at the same moment we have water up there being held up in the sky by gravity. To catch 22, is gravity holding the water to the ground or is gravity pushing the water up into the sky and holding it up there? H2O on the ground, H2O in the air. Where are you, gravity? Pulling the H2O to the ground or pushing the H2O up in the sky? Short and sweet, folks. Think about that one. Clouds are water. That's water. Clouds are in the sky. Water's on the ground. How's gravity holding on to this water but pushing that water into the sky? How does gravity work? Will one of you ball zealots please inform me? Because... I really don't think it exists. I think you've been brainwashed. Even on the NASA website, NASA knows teaching K through fourth grade that clouds are H2O molecules that have condensed onto dust particles ice crystals and sea salt well if gravity pulls things to the ground then how does the dust particles ice crystals and sea salt just float around up there so that the water condensed to it to the first place you see the problem, folks? There's no such thing as gravity. It's a theory. It's never been proven. That's why it's always called the theory of gravity and not the law of gravity. Anyway, y'all be well and have a good day. Let that sink in.